I wonder when Mr. Horn will come on live on Zoom. It's been four or five weeks since he last bothered to show up. I am going to destroy his fucking arsehole with my feet. With shoes on. Uh, if we make an effort, at least once a week. Um, and a 1.5 next weekend. Mmm. Oh. Let's hope it shows up Monday night. Or even not covered it out for tonight. Definitely looking forward to the 1.5, which he must turn up for now because it doesn't make much of an effort the past few weeks. And then we can have uh, homemade uh, spag ball Friday. Uh, if he gets himself some of that uh, picante Chicago pizza things, and I'll get mine for Friday night and then Saturday. Poodle. Yes, as the picante some twin Chicago town pizzas. Get two box then, Mr. Hong, Friday night, and get two king pot noodles for Saturday night, as well as providing chili on the Saturday, Friday, and curtain number six on the Saturday. Ah, but order it with your shopping. Two box of picante Chicago town pizzas and two king pot noodles. I'll get in mine tomorrow and I'll put them aside for one o'clock nosh Friday and one o'clock nosh Saturday. But we'll be having quit number six. Ah. And the usual taxi fares in kind. We can get on the way home on Friday. Ah. And we can rattle through those films, which we can't really do on a 0.75. These are rare 1.5s, rare. Believe me, we have a mountain of films to catch up on, which we can make a head start on the Friday. Like I said, this is only possible because I booked this week off. We haven't had a proper 1.5 for some time. And we've got Airport 79, which is finally general. Um, straw Dogs. Disciple of Death. Uh, corruption, the fiend, psychopath. When it comes, twisted nerve. Uh, Monsters inside of me. Basket case one and two, level three. Um, blood on Satan's claw. But may watch Bloodbath at the House of Death again. It is quite funny. We need it to 1.5. We haven't had one since last November. Um, discount the Liverpool weekend, that was out of necessity. So, and there'll be a homemade spag ball on the Friday. And, um, as like I said, if you order to bring with you uh, two boxes of. Uh, picante uh, and some uh, it's a little small round twin pizzas um, for the Friday night nosh with your shopping bring it with you and two king pot noodles for Saturday night one o'clock nosh and I'll get mine as well but I'll do as main tea on the Friday and we're out at number six uh, for the works on the Saturday. And plenty of films. My God. Oh, Satan's Triangle. But you'll, you'll, you'll like Disciple of Death. It's good. And, uh, uh, Show up tonight, Mr. Horn. And from now on, once a week, unless exceptional circumstances, this will be the longest period you haven't bothered to show up for a fucking live session. So, yes, your ass is going to be bludgeoned and pummeled till it looks like your face. So, never again. This is a request. There's one film which needs uh, 
lovely being restored, recolorized, all the scratchy lines uh, what, uh, eradicated, the painstaking process, total remastering. That is 1972's uh, partly financed by the late Mike Raven, a disciple of death, which I have from America on an import, and it's it's lovingly unrestored. It is a bit of major TLC. I hope the BFI can be the saviour of this classic with the late Ronald Lacey as well. You had an absolutely brilliant performance in uh, Conga with the late Michael Goff. Very butch fight. I like the film. It's uh, it's the trailer's really funny, but it is what it is. And I wish films were like this. Yeah, along with the uh, horrors of the Black Museum with the late Michael Gore. Classics. I don't know what's going off at Aston, but uh, they, I haven't seen the fridge pack of All Speckled Hen in their shops for quite a while. Although it is listed on the website, not on the Aston website, but it just show up. Pull the finger after your bottom and uh, get the fridge pack which is 10 times you know the cans in the box back in as the stars because Tesco's have it and Saves have it but most of you appear not to have it and you don't you know it's not good enough and also you need to alter your as the rewards app I really like Tesco's Scan the barcode at the scan and go area and all your details are on the scanner. May I suggest <clears throat> Tower of Evil, The Flesh and Blood Show, Let's Get Laid, Bless This House, Call It Carol. Just a few suggestions. Oh, that paint ad that he did back in the 70s. On this day that I may live. Brilliant. I oh, bloody forgot. And I've got it as well on Blu ray. Horror Hospital. With Lake Michael Goff, and I think it was. I mean, the thing that Skip Martin. Was in. Is it the Mask of the Red Death? With Vincent Price. With Patrick McGee as well. Who was also in the remake of The Black Cat. Um, yeah, that, more suggestions. So basically, the bill, Mr. Horn, for the rare 1.5. Uh, there no takeaway, so say 20 quid for booze, um, the usual for the taxi fare, so that's um, 15, well, 15 or the closest to it uh, of Henry, that's for your mother's taxi fare. And the spag ball I will produce, um, just bring your. Um, I find it as well. The you bring your pot noodles to Saturday night, and either one box or two boxes of the small little circular uh, Chicago town pizzas. But this particular one, picante something. I can't remember. It's bigger than N. Um, it's lovely. So, like I said, we'll get the uh, taxi fare on the way home on the Friday from local Sainsbury's. It's a fish offer. Um, and the usual taxi fare, uh, sorry, the booze bill, just on the Friday, uh, do the usual electronic wizardry 
from your bank account to my bank account but there'll be no takeaways to order because there'll be no need for any takeaways because we'll have our uh, our own Chicago Town double pizzas for a Friday night nosh and the pot noodles if we, have, if we have had both of them also might some Chicago Town pizza left over for the one o'clock nosh two o'clock nosh pizza o'clock nosh on a Saturday which is a rare 1.5 Fantastic 1.5 there'll be film, films, films spag ball set Friday and a pot noodles Friday night and then the, the picante the two of these Chicago Town pizzas but the picante is spicy without the sauce but not too spicy the 1.5 is very rare let's have it